You have a paper document that you need to get into Google Classroom as a readable PDF. Use the Office Lens app to do that very easily. Here's how. After installing the Office Lens on your device, open it up. As you approach your document, it will attempt to scan that document's outside edges. Take the picture. It doesn't even have to be perfectly straight on. It will automatically straighten it out and crop it out. You can use the cropping tools available to further crop it if needed. You can also notice a little camera app in the bottom left corner. You can add multiple pages. When you're done, select Done. You're next going to choose PDF as a choice. And if you choose OneDrive as your save location, it will then automatically add optical character recognition, which means it will grab the text out of that document such that tools like the Read and Write PDF Reader will be able to read it. Now, in your OneDrive, it will automatically upload to a folder called Office Lens. So once your OneDrive is open, scroll down, find the Office Lens, and all the newest files will have a little star beside it. This one was done a few seconds ago. Right next to that file, look for the three dots in your OneDrive, select it, choose Open, and Open in Browser. This will allow you to trigger the Read and Write PDF Reader extension. If it doesn't open automatically, you'll see in words up here the option to open in read and write PDF reader. Once it is open you can now select any of that text and you can use the text-to-speech features as well as the highlighters or anything else you might need to mark up that particular document in the PDF reader. To now get that in to your Google Classroom. First, save it to your Google Drive using this Google Drive icon. If this is difficult, you can simply download it and then look for upload options to Google Drive. But if you do see this Google Drive option here, you can go ahead and save it directly to there. You can search for the folder. You can organize by last modified or last used. Uh, whatever you need, select the folder you want it to go into and it will save it in that folder. Once it's in that folder, you'll be able to go into your Google Classroom, create the assignment, and if you wanted to give it to all of your students, you certainly could. That file is going to be in Google Drive and it will pull up your recently used files. Now, you may wish to make a copy for each student so they have their own copy that they can mark up. If it's not for all your students, if it's just for one or two students, you can uncheck all the students and just pick a particular student you want to send it to or a small group of students and then select Assign after you've given the title and instructions. And it's that easy. That file is now viewable and editable and readable in the Read and Write PDF Reader.